and this is the energy vibration reading for um, the um, Aries Sun Moon and Rising sign. I want to say to all you Aries um, that I have already had your birthdays. I'm sure you're seeing a lot of changes in your life. This is the, the last couple of days for your zodiac energy for the year 2018. So I want to say to you guys, I'm wishing you guys a really wonderful 2018. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is just going to be extremely wonderful. It's going to be a positive, positive um, week because you guys are handling your zodiac energy. This week is a water week, but from Monday until Thursday, it's going to be wonderful. And Friday until Saturday, the earth energies are bringing balance. Week is beginning from the 16th. It's the 16th week, and it's beginning from the 16th until the 22nd so this is wonderful um, so on Monday you Aries have the energy of the nine of uh, the nine of sword okay the energy of the nine of sword the nine of swords energy is a lot of worries for you Aries okay so let's see what that worries is about you have the knight of Pentacles so a lot of you have worries um, with the knight of Pentacles so the knight of Pentacles it could be your partner who is a, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. This could be a partner who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. Then you have the energy of the Queen of Pentacles in a reverse. Okay, so you have to deal with the Pentacles people because you have the Queen of Pentacles in reverse and you're dealing, um, you know, with a situation with the Knight of Pentacles. So let's see what is happening. Then you have another reverse energy, um, the Four of Pentacles in reverse. Okay, yeah, the Four of Pentacles in reverse. That means you or at this moment through all your savings and everything but there is good news that is coming and um, whatever the situation is um, some of you are relying on the Queen of Pentacles and it's as if you haven't heard anything okay let's see what is happening on Friday you're protecting yourself from the Knight of Pentacles so you're protecting yourself from someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn um, on Friday whoever this person is on Saturday you're seeing a situation very very clearly um, because the energy of the eight is there you're seeing a situation very very clearly on Sunday you have the energy of the star okay so this is good so whatever the situation is and whatever that is transpiring um, for some of you Aries over the age of 40 it's not going to be a good week for you guys okay so um, it's not going to be a good week for some of you guys and some of you guys are going to be um, doing something that is gonna get you in further in trouble so the men over 40 is not going to be a good week for you some of you and some of you are going to be doing something that is going to get in some serious serious trouble so be aware of that and advising you about that so let's look and see whatever is happening um some of you have a lot of worries on monday and the worries that you have have to do with someone who is then um um, who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn this person is between the ages of um, 18 to 20 for some people for some people 20 to 30 and for some people from 30 until 40 so whatever it is because I'm seeing the situation is that um, this person is either um, psychic not good or there is a situation that you know you're afraid of this person so let's see what is happening hi princess so it's as if um the the you're worried because there is you know that something um psychic uh, something is really not so good about this person okay there is a psychic situation that is not good about this person there's something about this person that is not very good um, that is happening okay and you're aware of this so let's see what is going to become in the outcome so you're going to be moving away from this situation so it's as if you're um, 
your intuition and your guidance is saying let this person go so it's someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn between the ages so it could be your son or your daughter and you're thinking you know they're really getting off um, I can't control them anymore so I'm going to leave them and let them um, go so some of you if you're in a relationship with um, someone who is a, a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn you're going to be walking away from them okay you're going to be protecting yourself by walking away from them and going on a new start leaving this relationship you listen to your intuition because obviously um, there is a lot of stuff you're very worried either that this person is psychic not or this person is going over the line or the you know there is something that is happening and it could be your child or it could be your partner or something let this person go okay so um, what is happening with uh, the Knight of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles is as if they have been having a relationship this is the energy of um, the um, um, a Capricorn and so whoever is the Queen of Pentacles is a Capricorn okay whatever the situation is between these two people you are going to walk away from it you are definitely going to walk away from it whatever is the situation you're going to definitely walk away from it okay you are going to definitely walk away from it so let's look at the queen and the four of pentacles the energy of the the, the sun is going to come out so whatever is happening um, for some of you um, a Capricorn could be helping you guys out in this week okay the energy of the Sun is coming out so a Capricorn could be helping um, some of you out in this week with your financial situation a Capricorn could be really really helping some of you out um, with your financial situation let's see what is transpiring in the middle of the week um, you're working very hard um, a Capricorn is um, supporting you um, this whoever is this Capricorn lady she's very psychic because the eye princess is there or the eye prince is a psychic woman and is a Capricorn because it's the Empress so whoever it, it can be I know it's a Capricorn or um, it could also be a Virgo but it's I'm if some people it's going to be a Virgo for some people it's going to be a Capricorn you could be working with this person um because or you're seeing a situation with this person so it's as if you know someone you are aware of someone and this could be that some of you are in a partner um your partner is seeing this capricorn woman and it's as if it's ending okay that's in relationship in normality Laven is as if this Capricorn woman um, is going to help you out financially or help you to find the right work or situation in your life okay um, the energy of the Sun is coming out because it's as if this Capricorn woman is psychic and she's going to heal something with you and bring out bring you back to an higher energy vibration okay let's look and see what is happening in the end of the week um, a lot of you who were resting is going to be or who was sick is going to be feeling much better or who had a situation with a family member who was a Capricorn um, it's going to feel better for the rest of the people honestly it's going to be a week where a lot of situation a lot of clarity is going to come about work or about if you're looking for work if you haven't have work for a time a lot of the situation your hobbies you're going to start finding your hobbies and that sort of a thing and this is going to be good because um, you are ending the week with the energies of the hair so it's in the weekend it's going to be um, extremely positive okay 
um, there's a judgment call that is coming whatever this judgment call is is as the ending okay so a lot of you um, who were dealing with someone between the age of 18 to 20 20 to 30 30 to 40 you're going to be ending a relationship and leaving and the situation behind and you're going to be block you're going to be receiving some messages that is going to be coming in okay let's see what else is happening you have um, an ending okay and this judgment call that is coming in is an ending okay so you could be um, because um, there's a conflicts and you're just going to be ending whatever this conflicts is as as you're gonna um, just think you know I'm leaving this behind I'm ending this I don't want to be in this anymore um, this is not something and this is not the place that I want to be so um, you're gonna decide um, to be ending this for some of you people um, over the age of 40 um, please whatever you are doing be aware because whatever you're doing you are going to be get you're going, going to get caught or um, it is as if um, someone or something uh, whatever um, whatever let's say whatever negative energy you're sending out it's going to be coming back to you okay um, so the focus of the week for you guys is the week of work and work is going to be the focus for you guys okay people who are in relationships are going to actually be leaving their relationship and walking away from their relationship for whatever reason it is um, people are going to decide to end their relationship and just walk away from their relationships um, and um, some of them are going to be ending their relationships because of a Capricorn or of a Virgo or a Taurus uh, or some of you who are with these people is going to be ending a relationship okay um, you, whatever the your you know whatever that your financial situation was or is um, there is going to be a sense of healing that is going to be coming in okay so um, there are things that is happening because I, I need to know what is this judgment call because the energy of the Sun is you know bringing positive energy at the end of the week okay because um, it's bringing positive energy to a situation that some of you have to deal with um, a Capricorn woman over the age of 40 for the rest you guys are doing a, a you know a wonderful job um, listen to um, your listen to your your intuition okay your materialistic things is going to be provided for you're working hard some of you are moving forward um, leaving a relationship if you are in a relationship with someone who is uh, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn some of you have a lot of worries and you're thinking about leaving the relationships behind okay let's see what is this judgment call that is coming in this judgment call is coming in from the Prince of thing there and it's fate you're you you need to rest and you're bringing a situation to an end which is good and it is a romantic situation uh, and then new love is going to be coming in okay so um, those who have decided to leave a romantic situation behind a new love is going to be coming in justice and your financial situation is going to uh, you have no worries no, no need to worries about you uh, um, no need to worry over your financial situation because this is going to be good okay so um, what I say to you guys I'm wishing you a wonderful positive um, week and um, please remember to go back and listen to the monthly readings because those are wonderful because it's going to give you more information that is come, going to come up for you Aries I really love you guys be careful for the people over the age of 40 be careful what you're going to do in this week because um, it's going to come back and hit you okay so I am warning you about this this is going to be a positive week energy of the Sun good news is going to come in okay if you had a health problem this is going to be you're going to be feeling um, good a lot of you are going to be ending situations and deciding to move forward in your life okay mm -hmm. 
the star eight number eight is good in this week for you guys 88 you have the energy eight a eight and four so four and eight is going to be a positive energy for you guys in this week four and eight um uh four and eight is it's gonna be a positive energy a lot of you have to deal with um the hurt sign people in this week and it is an fire and earth week so um this is what is happening okay if you decide to leave a situation behind um it is going to be good financially for you it's going to be much better okay i want to say thank you for being here and have a wonderful week